from Star and welcome to my channel Starlight Star Rate 70. If you're returning, thank you so much for coming back and if you are new, welcome. Come on in. So I just want to say howdy all. <laughs> I hope everyone's having a wonderful uh, day and they've had a great weekend. Today is Sunday. It is our fun day and I'm so looking forward to sharing something with you today. Um, but before we start with that, we're going to do our, um, our message of the day. And today I picked out two cards. And the first card says, This is a day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. And that comes from Psalms 118, 24. This is my favorite verse. And it's something that I repeat every morning when I wake up. This is how I start my day right here. Repeating this verse. And just thanking God that he has blessed me with another day and the sun was up this morning the birds were singing it was just absolutely beautiful here this morning and then the second card that I picked was uh, this card here and it says faith is a substance of things hoped for the evidence of things not seen Hebrews 11 1 so, so yeah, have faith. Faith is so important. Even if you can't see it, just have faith. Um, yeah, I have a lot of faith. <laughs> I have a lot of faith in a lot of things. <laughs> Not seen, but, uh, but anyway. Uh, really, really good messages today. And, um, yeah, I just, I just really enjoyed them. And I hope you did too. Alright, so I'm going to show you some of the little uh, projects I worked on this week. I did some little keychains. Uh, it's for a benefit that's for the end of this month. Or, sorry, not this month, but next month. And here's the first one. Isn't that just the cutest? So they are on both sides. Oh, and it's got a little piece of hair stuck to it. <laughs> Fuzzy Wuzzies with the kitty cats. There you go. So there is some bit of hair stuck to these just because I've had them hanging up. And then here's another little puppy I did. So, so cute. And again, they're just little keychains and they are on both sides. I love, love this one. And then I did a bunch of casses. And again, they're their keychains or whatever you want but yeah just absolutely gorgeous and these ones too are double sided so really pretty and here's another one I really like this one so this was gonna focus this uh, I don't know I have two favorites it would be this one here and probably this one here are my two favorites. But yeah, really, really nice. And then I did these two. So those are some of my little projects I did th throughout the week. Um, of course, I finished off uh, uh, Sheba last week and then I've just been working on my Canadian flag and doing these little projects in between. So that's basically it. That's all I did this week. Oh, and I did start on my cross stitching. I just show you. So I started off with the bookmark. Um, right here. So you can see I got the outline done. That doesn't even look too bad in the back. <laughs> for not doing it for so many years. So yeah. So, I did mark it off with that pen that I, that everyone was so helpful with, letting me know what everything was, so thank you so very much. I so appreciated that, because I was like, oh my, I haven't crossed it for a long time. <laughs> so anyway, so I started with that, and uh, thoroughly enjoyed doing that, so I was very, very happy. Alright guys, so this is what we got I got something in the mail and it is 
paint by number. So this company reached out to me. Um, the company's name is, one moment, uh, let me just get the company name, houseart.uk. Uh, that's the company name and so they reached out and they said hey we watched uh, your channel and would you mind reviewing some products uh, with your um, RV family they didn't say RV family but you know yeah my RV family and I said absolutely I would love to so I was able to pick out two items so the two items I picked out is well this came too, and I believe this is just a frame for after you're done your painting. So they do supply the frame. The painting was $16.99, and I thought, well, I can't do a painting without, um, I can't do a painting without, whatchamacallit, brushes. So I did order brushes, so I'm hoping they're somewhere in here, because they weren't in the bag. Oh my. So. When I used to paint by number, many, many, many years ago, it used to come on a cam, like a, a wooden, not really wooden, but a, what do you call that? You know, the canvas, the, um, whatever, the canvas. But this comes on a different kind of canvas. <laughs> oh, anyway, the canvas that you hang up on the wall, you know, the little square ones or whatever. That's what my paint, paint, uh, paint by number used to come on. But this actually is a canvas. And I picked out a kid's one because I thought, okay, well, I'm not that great at painting. <laughs> I never used to be. Oh, here they are. Oh, and it came with it. Oh, so, okay, so these kits come with everything you need. It comes with your paintbrushes, it comes with a little sticker, and it comes with your paint. But look at this little guy. So this is a little one that I picked out to do, right there, and all the paints come with it, and there's your paintbrushes, so it does come with paintbrushes, oh well. But when I open this, and here's the paintbrushes that I ordered, and so it gives you a paper guide right here, yeah. Huge. And then here's the painting. Now I was expecting just a little painting, but this is what I got. Right there. So that should be fun. It is quite large. And the size isn't even on here. At least it's not on the canvas. So I'd have to go to the website and just see what the uh, size of this one is. But looking at it, I'd say it's at least a 40 by a 40 by 50. I'm gonna say even maybe 40 by 60. And I'm gonna say 40 by 50. Um, it does. Actually, I got my measuring tape. So let's measure this this uh, painting. Now this company. Uh, this company, I believe, is in the UK. It's called House Art UK. So, I believe that's where they are. So, this one, yeah. So, it's a 40. So, the true 40. And then, I'm just going to say this one is probably 60. Let me see. No, 50. So, it is a 40 by 50. So there you go. So it's a true 40 by 50 picture. And we are going to do some coloring or some painting. I thought that would be so cool. Now, on their website, they have a lot, a lot of different uh, paintings. So when you first go on, this is what their site looks like. Right there. This is House of Art there. If it will focus, there we go. And then, so it has bestsellers, it has new arrivals, it has animals, plants, landscape, popular festival, multi-panel, religion, kids, difficulty, and tools. So that's what I got. I got these um, brushes here, and then also this painting here. So the painting was $16.99, and I think these brushes were $6.99. 
so let me just double check here and like I said it did come with the frame and if you were to just purchase a frame on their site it's $8.99 so oh they have some really cool things so uh, This one says $8.99. Ten brush for acrylic paint, different sizes and shapes is $8.99. I believe that's what I got. So, right there. I don't know if my phone's not going to focus. Oh no. Oh, here, let's turn off the TV for number one. Whoops. <laughs> Wrong button. Forgot I was watching something this morning. So, yeah. And of course you're going to get all the glare that's you know there we go so there it is right there and so yeah they have a bunch of different um they got brush holders they have magnifying glasses they got paint by number mystery box hmm, that would be fun so but anyway so that's accessories now they're be let's look at some of their best sellers and, and uh, right now they have buy two get one free so if you really like paint by number and most of these are all $16.99 so my kitties are running around like crazy this morning okay enough guys enough <laughs> they're chasing one another so they look very much like the diamond paintings really but they're paint by number So I just thought it was it would be uh, cool just to try something different. Like I said, I haven't painted by number f probably since I was in school, and uh, so yeah, it's been a long time. Oh, let's see, this one's beautiful. I love this one. But yeah. So, like I said, it has been a long time. And like I said, they're all $16.99. It says tax included and buy two, get one free. Now, I don't know if there is a... Okay, so free shipping is if you spend $35 or more. So that is their site. So really, really cool. So what I'm going to do is I'm not going to worry about that frame right now. I'm going to flip you around or maybe I'll just flip you down. And we're going to try this painting oh my goodness like I said the last time I painted was quite a while ago and blizzard you're okay hey blizzy crazy 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 kitty all right be right back all right I'm back so this is the brush set I have them out here and they seem like to be pretty good quality. They are just a plastic. And uh, their tips are, this one's nice and soft. This one's a bit harder. This one is soft. This one here is uh, soft as well. This one's a harder one. This one's definitely harder. This one is soft. Very, very nice and soft and soft so you have three harder ones here and then you have a bunch of soft ones so on the back of the package here let me just move that out of the way um you'll see oh sorry you will see what each of these paint brushes are for so that's really kind of cool i need that <laughs> um yeah well, actually, yeah, um, I probably not very good at. We got fan, we got dagger, we got one stroke. Probably need a one stroke. I'm not sure. Anyway, we'll f we're going to figure this out. All right. So we're gonna open this up. Now I presume these are. Uh, oh, so this this here is actually a little sticker. So cute. 
So that's what we're doing right there. We're making our little thing. And then, okay, so in this one it comes with hangers to hang up your painting on the wall. So yeah, it definitely comes with everything you need. Wow. All right. So I believe this is acrylic. And these are the brushes that came in the pack. So there's only three here. And there's three different shapes there, if you can see that. So that was that's their package. But we're going to use the ones that I got. So it does come on this nice little tray here, which is really, really nice. I like that. And let's do number, I guess we should start, wait, I'm left-handed. So let's start over this side first right here. And hopefully you can see that right right here. <laughs> can you see that okay? Or do I have to move you a little bit? See if I can move you. There we go. Hopefully that's good. So we're going to start off right here with number 17. So I'm not sure if I'm supposed to dip these in water first or what. And can I even get them off? Oh, here. It's like, ooh, can I even get them off? So they do have a little clip here, which is nice. Ooh. So it's been a while since I've even painted, so. Now I know this was in there. There we go. Perfect. So I'm going to just take... Let's do... What, let's do this size of brush, just to start off with, because... I'm going to use these two, I think. And I'm just going to dip. I don't think we need to add water or anything to this. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, we're starting over here at number 17. I'm like, oh, wait. So, like I said, this is a just like a regular canvas. And it's quite cool. Hopefully I'm not shaking you too much and you can see this. Can you guys see? Move it over just a little bit more. Well, I don't know how it's supposed to go over the numbers. Like, do I have to like paint it over twice? Or do these numbers actually just rub off? help <laughs> I don't know I'm not even sure about that because it definitely is not thick enough to really paint over that number I guess so maybe you have to like give it another coat or something I'm not sure Like I said, it's been years since I did any kind of paint by number, and I always had a hard time staying in the lines, but sorry, my kitty jumped up on the couch there. Okay, so then I'm going to put this in the water. I think you have to leave it in the water. And I'm going to go, I think with this one. Does that look right? I'm not sure. I don't even know if they sent enough paint, but we will we shall see. Oh, see I've already gone over that line a little bit. Whoops. I guess it doesn't really matter. So you don't want the lines to show anyway. But yeah, I just don't know what to do with this number here because it's not covering up. So this um, canvas definitely soaks in this paint. So 
So yeah, I'm not sure how, how much to use of it. I mean, you want to use enough to cover your little spots there, but it is quite something. Okay, I think this uh, this little part here is going to be almost done. Yeah, you can still see the number through there though. So I am not sure. I don't think there's anything to... Watch me, watch it say, oh, we'll peel off this layer, but nope. <laughs> so with my luck, I guess now it's covered. Okay, so I guess with just a number, you have to go over it a couple times, because now that's covered. So do you see that there? That's the very first one. So now number 22. So number 22 is just tiny. So did I bring a, you know what I forgot is a cloth. Oh no, here's one. Get a cloth here. Okay, got my cloth. All right, so close that one up. And then this one here and this, well, maybe. Maybe not. Okay. It should just go down, right? There we go. So this one is 22. I'm going to open this one up. Oh, jeez. There we go. Stick it back in there. And there we go. All right, 22. This is just a very little one. I think this would probably be easier to do if you had it like maybe on an easel or something. Um, stretched out, I'm thinking. But yeah, so even when the paint dries, you can still see these numbers. So I'm not sure about that, the, the numbers there. I don't know if you can see that on camera or not, but definitely you can see number 22 there, and that's not good. And also, I don't think we want these um, lines to be seen either. And I don't know how to cover those lines up from, because they're so black. But maybe, no, I don't think you can wash this after either. I'm not sure. That's number 22. You can still see number 22. <laughs> it is pretty fast drying paint. 
And I just want to look here real quick again at this website. And I'm going to look at the painting that I bought, which was kids. would have been cute. Of course, when I want it, I can't find it. And it's, I have my email on my other phone that I'm using for recording, so my apologies, guys. But I guess while I'm scrolling, I don't know how much you can see of this. But here are just some of their pictures here. But um, I may have to look for a giraffe. Let me see. It's only four of them, so it shouldn't take too long to go through these. Oh, that's so cute. Is it? Here it is. I think this is the one that I picked right here. So there, there's the the painting that I picked. So cute. But um. Oh wait, this one has horns going up, and I don't think mine has horns. Oh wait, no. There must be another one that looks just like this one. Here it is. Uh, almost the same. So this is the one that I picked out right here. There it is. And so uh, so they gave me the 40 by 50. So you can get them in all different sizes there. I don't know if you can... Excuse me. I don't know if you can see all those different sizes there, but they come in different sizes. And uh, you can do 24 colors, 36 colors, which is a bestseller, or 48 colors are detailed. You can get it without frame or with frame. Uh, it says paint by numbers is easy and anyone can do it. Each area on the canvas is numbered and corresponds to, to the specific color. There is no need to mix the colors, just use a brush to color in the appropriate areas. You can also decide the order of coloring according to your wish. Finally, you will create your own piece of artwork that you can be proud to show off to your family and friends. <laughs> okay, so, so it is high quality, safe acrylic paints, non-toxic. Order, odorless and environmental friendly so that's the paints um, the colors have natural shine oil canvas with high resolution printing does not fade easily and does not tire the eyes okay so so it does come with the, as you can see with the wrinkle free canvas and Whether you're skilled, okay, so it doesn't really say what to do with the numbers. So I'm not sure, guys, if, because these numbers, I can see them still. I can, for example, I can see number 22 and I can see 77. 77, sorry, I can see 17. I don't know if you can see that. See if I can bring it down just a little bit more. Whoops. Yeah, let's do it this way. See that? I don't know if you can see it on camera or not. But yeah. Sorry for bumping you around and everything. How's that? Is that good? Is it, you're all settled? Alright. Well, let's try number 21. We'll just go down the list here. 
Okay, so these are not easy to close, which is probably a good thing because that means they're, they will uh, stay closed, hopefully. There we go. And then this one here is number 21. So let's try number 21. This is like a gray color. There we go. Alright, so 21 has quite a bit of area. Okay. Here we go. Can you see that okay? Hopefully you can. We're going to do number 21. Now there's a lot of paint on the lid on this one. Now, I know, with, I remember with the other paints that I used to paint with, you had to mix them, but I don't think you have to mix these ones because they're not oil based. They're, they're acrylic based. Got a train going by. Choo choo. Very, they don't actually honk the horn very often. Not here where we are. Okay, so. I used a lot more paint this time for this one and I don't know how it's going to dry but Well, this one covers up the lines. So the darker gray color here does cover up the lines for the black lines. So that's nice. And then it goes way up in there and there's no way I can do that with this brush. So just clean that one off. Grab this one. Well, I have to say you need really good eyesight for this. Um, I think there would be... Because you have to get like follow kind of where the pattern's going and... I can see someone that struggles with their eyes might not... This might not be for them, but... If you like coloring, this would be perfect, I think. And I just went into the red. Or, I mean, I went into number eight. Hopefully number eight is a darker, oh good, it's a blue. So it should cover that up. So yeah. There's a little piece here that says number eight and I colored over it. So I mean it's, um, to me it is, there's like a bunch of little numbers here and I just covered another one up. Whoops. Okay, so that went up there. 
And then I think it goes down here to here, I think. And I think this one's an eight, so it's not that. And then you have in between here. So yeah. Well, that one's eight, so I don't want to do eight, but I can do twenty-one is here. I was trying to see about blending it into the other color there. And it goes way up here, number 21. It goes back way up here, but... But again, it has a big number here. So, yeah, I, don't, I just don't know how to hide the numbers on this canvas. If anybody has any ideas, let me know, please, and because I can't figure it out. And I know you can't wash it afterwards, I don't think. Anyway, so it goes way, way up there. And yeah. So that is um, kind of what I wanted to show you. So thank you, House Art, for um, wanting to collab with me. And it is an adorable little, little picture. It is a beautiful little giraffe here. Um, I might work on it some more. Uh, probably not today because I want to do my diamond painting, but um, it is, I would say it's almost kind of relaxing. Well, a little bit stressful. <laughs> oh my goodness, I don't know how to explain it. Um, it's relaxing yet stressful at the same time because, yeah, I have a hard time staying in lines. But the paintbrushes seem to work really, really well. No issues at all with these paintbrushes. And really, like I said, a really, really nice set, and you get a bunch of them. Like, like I said, they were, I think they were $6.99. And I'll put the prices, I'll put the links, everything will be in my description. And, yeah. Uh, don't forget, tomorrow, um, I will probably won't be putting out a video during the day, but I will be coming on later on in the evening with my husband. So please watch out for that. I'll try to put a premiere, whatever it's called, ahead of time. Uh, just to remind you guys that uh, we'll be on tomorrow night. And I think that's it. So I just wanted to show you that. I mean, it is a beautiful canvas. It's really nice paints. They say I really like this tray. They got lots of whites. So I'll definitely like to do these big areas. <laughs> These little areas are a little bit um, hard, but this canvas can be rolled up when you're not working on it. Of course, you have to wait for it to dry, but it does say that it can be rolled up and it doesn't crinkle. So it's almost like that burlap material. 
in a way. So, so yeah, that is that. Let me just move you up here. Whoops, kind of close. <laughs> there we go. All right, guys. Thank you for watching and for having patience with me while I paint. <laughs> I wanted to try it out. I think I'll stick to my cross stitching and I'll stick to my diamond painting. And um, but thank you again so very much, uh, House Art, for thinking about me and asking me to promote uh, your paintings. I think they're beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Um, if you guys wouldn't mind, go check out their website and just see what they have. Um, maybe somebody in your family loves to paint. Or maybe you love to paint. Um, yeah, it's almost like coloring. Except for with paints. <laughs> oh, but yeah, I just... Uh, this. I mean, it's just adorable. I mean, just absolutely adorable. So... But anyway. Again, thank you for joining me. I hope you have a most wonderful day. Um... What am I going to do? Oh, yeah, I'm going to dye and paint. That's what I'm going to do. I've been working on my flag, working, 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 and I'm going to be working on it some more today and probably tomorrow. Because <laughs> uh, I was doing those, I, I did some things in between, and then I last night I thought, I'm going to try my cross stitching. So I got that out and I tried that. So, but anyway. From my home to yours, I hope you have a most wonderful day, evening, afternoon, whatever time it is for you guys. And as always, God's richest blessings. Mwah. See you on the next one.